What's up guys? Welcome back to Shuckle, back to another video. And in today's video, we are working on my brother's 328. We're taking this to its first car meet tomorrow, and we're also taking the F80 on its first car meet tomorrow. We're going to Showman Motors. We're going to Showman Motors, guys. Yeah, for those of you guys who don't know, the car meet's about to be, honestly, it's gonna be uh, in this video. Actually, it's gonna be the next video because it's tomorrow morning, and this video is dropping tomorrow morning. So, uh, yeah, next video, hopefully, is gonna be the car meet. It's my first ever car meet. I'm hoping a lot of you guys make it out there. If not, I, I don't know when my next one's gonna be, but this one's gonna be partnered up with Showman Motors because there's a huge line. I think it's gonna be absolutely insane. So super excited about that. Also have some big news for myself coming up pretty soon. So I'm super excited for about that. But anywho, uh, right before I shake down the car meet, we did have a few more things ordered up from Sylvaneer. So Sylvaneer, they have some carbon fiber stuff right here. So they have some side skirts for the E90s. I don't really know much people that actually sell side skirts for the E90s, carbon fiber. Uh, so as Sylvaneer happens to have those, which is pretty awesome. And they actually have a replica M3 style front carbon fiber lip for this car. I had it on my first Airbnw. I don't know anywhere else that sells that lip. So again, how to go through Sylvaneer for that. So we got the front lip, the side skirts from my boys of Sylvaneer. Super excited to throw those on. We also got some all season floor mats because my brother doesn't have any floor mats. Uh, it's been raining like crazy, right bro? So uh, yeah, it's been, it's been bad. It's been bad. <laughs> yeah, we had to get some all season floor mats. We got those from FCP Euro just because, I mean, why not? Or if you can order them through FCP Euro for cheaper and they're OEM, mine as well. It's literally the BMW ones, but uh, OEM with a lifetime warranty if you ever need to use that for some reason on floor mats. But I guess if your dog eats it, you'll be good. And then we have one more special mod. If you guys saw the thumbnail, you guys know what it is. It's gonna be towards the end of the video. I am super hyped for it. It's gonna make the interior pop so nicely. We got it from Pick and Pull for ninety dollars, right? I think ninety bucks. What? 60 bucks. 60 bucks. This next mod I'm about to show you guys, hopefully towards the end of the video. It is insane, guys. This thing's gonna be an absolutely amazing transformation. It's already come such a long way. We're gonna have to do the building in 10 minute video on this thing because from where it came from to where it is right now, day and night, guys. So without further ado, let's go and show you guys the good stuff. They do look good. Oh, that's that all season, guys. Real, like this is the authentic BMW all season floor mats. Oh, these look good, dude. These gonna look so good. And just like that, guys, you have everything settled down. So we got the full aluminum trip from Pick and Pull. Shout out to my boy Erlon and Jonathan. They went down to Pick and Pull to get some things for our new car of theirs. Uh, you know, hint, hint. Uh, but anyway, they found a full set for the E90, and my brother obviously had a cop of sixty dollars, guys, for a full aluminum trim. And it just so happens to be one without the nav as well. It was so perfect for my brother. We had to cop it. And uh, yeah, these are the carbon fiber ones from Sylvaneer. What I absolutely love about it is that it actually has the extension, so not just holes too. So it's gonna be super easy to bolt this on. And the lip itself is again this lip is super hard to find and actually they have a couple more in stock so for those of you guys who have m3 rep bumpers hit up souvenir get this lip we also have the 3m tape that goes with this bad boy they're also going to be using some self-tapping screws on this and then we're going to finish it off with some beautiful oem bmw all season floor mats winners hitting guys it's raining you need them floor mats bro so uh that's gonna be pretty sick so i think first things first let's go ahead and get into the side scoops because i really want to see this on the car Just like that guys, you have the carbon fiber side skirts on there. And I think it's literally the perfect amount of like extrusion. Since the M3 side skirts have like a lot of bulkiness, the front looks obviously more tucked in. Actually, ah, yeah, it looks more tucked in, but it's actually very proportional. It looks really, really, really good. So yes, talk about nice looking fitment. Really easy to go on once you have some self-tapping screws. Um, this doesn't come with self-tapping screws or 3M, so just keep that in mind. But yeah, guys, if you guys want some E90 carbon fiber side skirt extensions, which I honestly couldn't find anywhere but Sylvanier, make sure to check out their link down below. The next thing is gonna have to be that lip. We got the glass black grills on the front, and we have some carbon fiber mirror caps, but the only, that's the only two black things in the front end. I think this lip's gonna really bring it together. Obviously, you painted the wheels black. We got those also smoked out. Door handles are black we got the carbon fiber spoiler and then we also did a tail lights so a little black access we definitely have to do a uh, diffuser as well one of these days but any heels also, <laughs> let's go ahead and install that lid So now that we have the 3M on the lip, the 3M did actually come with this and it's not like some cheap 
tape. This is the actual 3M, so it's super nice. It did come with the front lip. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and not only use the tape, I'm actually going to be also using the riveting screws just because they're really, really, really nice. And uh, if we actually do chip anything on the highway, it won't take the entire lip, it'll just slightly crack it. And that's obviously better than losing your entire lip. So uh, yeah. All we gotta do now is just heat it up. Go put this bad boy on the car. I am so excited. This is my first carbon fiber lip I've ever gotten on any of my cars before. Uh, on my e first ever E90, and I destroyed it twice. It's just such a nice lip though. I mean, hopefully, hopefully my brother's not gonna be uh, <laughs> as irresponsible <laughs> as I was. Any <laughs> Oh, we just, dude, Bruh. the power just cut off. <laughs> it's spooky in here. You think it's because of this? What? No, no, it's not here. Did you this off? No. The whole neighborhood, right? Dude, I can't see. Bro, what are the odds of that? <laughs> I'm not time for this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, dude. This is the second time this week. <laughs> oh, okay, man. let's get out of here, dude. Bro, oh, yeah. I'm going to trip over the wire, bro. <laughs> bro, is it only us? It's an apocalypse, bro. Bro, did we do that? No. No, we plugged in a... Bro, but why is all their house lights on if ours is off? Ours is off? Yeah. Aw, oh, man. Feels bro. bad, bro. <laughs> bro, what is this? <laughs> he can really do that. They also plug it into the extension cable. It's connected. Are you really going to blame He's me for that? plug it into the extension cable. It's connected to the extension cable. <laughs> <laughs> he said that won't be a problem. <laughs> oh. oh, man. My dad's going to come. Oh, I'm just going to pretend like I don't live here anymore. Oh, actually, I don't live here anymore. Any easels. Uh, okay, let's just pretend that didn't happen. Okay. And just like that guys, we got the lip on the car. I actually made one mistake and I went from like too close to the edge and punctured right there. Um, obviously that's not a she, ooh, look at the, my brother. Ooh, okay, okay, it's gonna be a lot lower. My brother's definitely gonna be riding a lot lower now. But yeah, I already chipped it. It's gonna be one of a few rock chips that this thing's gonna get anyways. But it's looking so, so, so good. This is the front piece that it needed to really complete the front end. Dude, I cannot wait to see it. Like, this thing looks so good at the car show, bro. Really? Like, bro, for a car that we got for 1500 bucks, this thing's looking so, so, so very good. Let's just see how long this thing will last. That's my question, bro. Front lips, bro, give it like two months. That's the longest it ever lasts. God, I'm just, I mean, for me, even. Like, even for me, bro, I'm not gonna lie. Like, front lips just don't last long. But man, that is gorgeous. And I hope this one lasts long because this is a very, very, very hard lip to come by. Again, Souvenir has a couple of these in stock. If you guys want them, make sure to check out Souvenir down below. Now, the next thing, now that we got the side skirts on, it looks so good. The front lip. I think the next thing is going to have to be the aluminum trim. Oh my God, bro. This is going to transform the interior. And we got the floor mat. Aluminum trim first. Let's go ahead and get into those. Oh, look at the difference. Oh, look at that. That looks amazing, dude. <laughs> Guys, that's one piece. Oh my god, this thing still looks so much better. This is so satisfying, bro. Do you remember that this window didn't work when we first got it? Yeah. This window didn't work, guys. And then uh, we had a bunch of issues. I think this was even missing on this door too. We went ahead and replaced the inner and outer uh, door handle itself, which looks so much better. And we got the chrome there as well. Obviously, I have to clean that off, but bro, <laughs> this, like this ten times better. was a nightmare when we first got it. It didn't look like much damage, but uh, whoever that had this before has neglected this car entirely. Like literally was. It was on his last leg. Like literally everything that broke, they didn't fix it. They just like kind of like, again, put a piece of wood in the door. <laughs> it was insane. Anyways, let's get to the other side. So far we knocked out the two pat the two driver side doors. Um, let's knock out the other side real quick.
shoot, bro. <laughs> Wow, this doesn't look like your first time. This ain't my first rodeo, bro. I've owned a couple of these suckers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, dear heavens. This interior is looking so much better. Unfortunately, it is super dark. Hopefully in an upcoming video, I'll be showing you guys an update on this car. Once everything is detailed, this car needs a really, really good detail. Um, I think my brother, honestly, because we got a little bit of water on the carpets, I think what we're gonna have to properly do is get a proper detail for the full interior, take it to somebody that knows what they're doing and just literally clean every crevice on this car because it is disgusting. Also, the, the, the seats itself need some detailing. So I think a proper detail for this car is all it really needs and the interior is gonna be absolutely perfect. So that should be an upcoming video, hopefully. But yeah, guys, aluminum absolutely killed it. Let's go ahead and throw in the floor mats because that's the last finishing touch. And this thing should be uh, ready to rock and roll for the next 300,000 miles. Woo! Bro, oh, that fit mint though. That's so snug. That looks so good, dude. Oh, buddy, off the driver's side. OEM guys look so good. Look at that fitment, like, oh my God. Um, but yeah, look at it from over here. The aluminum with the brown just looks so good. And also guys, it reminds me of the first day we had the 330i. <laughs> Jeez Louise, bro. <laughs> Happy Halloween. <laughs> oh my God. But yeah, guys, my first, first ever E90. We put in the brown interior with the aluminum trim. It looks so good. This thing is just like literally just reminding me, especially with the M3 front bumper with the M3 style front lip. It is looking so good, guys. But anywho, that's gonna have to conclude the video. Happy Halloween for those of you guys who celebrate it. Um, I'm honestly not a big fan of Halloween, but I mean, if you guys are, have fun. Um, without further ado, guys, I'll catch you on the next one. Probably the next video is gonna be on the E36 M3. So uh, stay tuned. Without further ado, guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay humble. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth.